Florida hit an 18 month low of coronavirus cases over Thanksgiving weekend, and there are still ways you can protect yourself. Of course, there are vaccines if you choose to get a vaccine, but also monoclonal antibody treatment after you have been diagnosed with COVID, of course. Jacksonville is home to a treatment site. Leah Shields has more on the details of how it is moving and how another site's opening back up. This was the site for the monoclonal antibody treatment. You could see signs at the library still saying temporarily closed, but today 9 a.m. The library reopens that new monoclonal antibody treatment site is now in Northwest Jacksonville at the Joseph Lee Center. It'll be open seven days a week from nine to five. The library was shut down for about four months. Treatment centers like this one specifically gained a lot of attention when this photo went viral from the Jacksonville location. A woman saying she was very sick with COVID, thought she would end up in the hospital. She came here, got the treatment and recovered. The treatment is just four shots and in Jacksonville, about 12,000 people have received it according to the city. Again, the Joseph Lee Center, it's already open. It's the new monoclonal antibody treatment site. Again, open seven days a week and there shouldn't be any future conflicts. Only one day in February, the special election, it is a precinct site, but that's the only conflict we could see with that site. It should be clear to stay open. Leah Shields, First Coast News on your side.